The Newtown High School Drama Club rehearsed on Tuesday, November 15th for this weekend's production of George Bernard Shaw's Pygmalion, which will be performed November 18th and 20th. Pygmalion follows the efforts of phonetics professor Henry Higgins as he attempts to transform a rough-around-the-edges Eliza Doolittle from a cockney flower girl into a duchess, thanks to a bet. NHS senior Alexandra Eng stars as Eliza in the performance, and junior Thomas Primavera will play the role of Henry Higgins. Directors and NHS seniors Autumn Jones and Sarah DeRozier spoke on Tuesday about the play. Um, I wanted to direct initially, but then I've never acted before. I've always just done crew things, so I needed someone to direct with me who was on the actor side, and I couldn't think of anyone, so I wasn't going to at the end of last year, and then Autumn came up to me and was like, hey, you want to help me direct? And I was like, oh, sure, okay. Because I had the same story where I don't know anything about the technical side, so I was like, well, Sarah's on crew. She works for Mr. Sweats, and she does all this stuff with the light board, and I was like, well, perfect. She's one of my best friends, so it worked out really well that way. Oh, my gosh. Uh, there's a lot of reasons why people should see it. Um, well, we have a really great cast, and um, they were, they're working really hard, so they want a lot of support. And... Um, it's just it's just a fun show like working with these actors and reading the story it's just so much fun to follow and I don't think we've done a British show before so I think we've done a couple but not in my high school career <laughs> <laughs> but the other one, like I work sound so I've watched every show that we've done like 15 times each and I gotta say this one's a lot more enjoyable than some of the others so <laughs> it's definitely a fun play to watch and it's fun to pick up on some of the things that are going on. And we've read this script every day since we first got it over the summer, and it still hasn't gotten old for us, so it's a lot It's a lot of fun. Demon ship eat. Uh, how do you do it, if I may ask? Oh, simply phonetics. Oh, the science of speech. That is my profession, also my hobby. Happy as man if you can make a living by his hobby. You can spot an Irishman or a Yorkshireman by his brogue. I can place any man within six miles two miles within London, sometimes within two streets. Not to be ashamed of himself, unmanly coward! But is there a living in that? Oh yes, quite a fat one. This is an age of upstarts. Men begin in Kentish Town with 80 pounds a year and end in Park Lane with 100,000. They want to drop the Kentish Town in their butt. They give themselves away every time they open their mouths. Now I... Oh, let us say what he likes, mind his own business and leave a poor girl! Well, you cease that detestable boo-hoo or seek the shelter of some other place of worship. Well, I've a right to be here if I like, same as you. A woman who utters such depressing and disgusting sounds has no right to be anywhere, no right to live. Remember that you are a human being, the soul, and the divine gift of articulate speech, and that your native language is the language of Shakespeare and Milton and the Bible, and don't sit there crooning like a bilious pigeon. <laughs> Well, what do you expect me to say to you? Well, if he was a gentleman, you might ask me to sit down, ask me. 